this morning we are off to um, see Luke's parents and we've grabbed ourselves a yummy coffee and walnut cake to take. We've got some beautiful tulips. However, we are also really hungry, so I grabbed myself a little yo sushi hoisin duck and standard packet of crisps. And Luke's got a uh, sausage roll. So we are en route, we've got to get some fuel and visit some um, family and then we'll be back home and I will show you a few bits at home when I get there. morning and welcome back to another vlog i didn't really kind of introduce the vlog there so i do apologize today i'm gonna pot up my hello petal order with you i've also got two herbs to pot up and i've got two bits to unbox with you if you'd have seen my previous vlog i did an um unboxing of some beautiful flow flowers so if you haven't seen it go and check them out and i've got something arrived today well it didn't arrive the other day but i'm going to open it with you um which is gonna be very exciting, so I can style those up. So I don't know whether to start off with potting or unboxing. Let's do unboxing and then we'll do my Hello Petal bits. Um, I've also got some seeds that have, have arrived, but they've arrived at the office, so I've got to pop and go get the seeds. And then I can show you which bits I'm planning on planting this year. But yeah, all very exciting. It is a, a gorgeous day today, which just makes everything so much more happier and it's sunny and oh also my tulips let me show you so the tulips that are in my beds oh you can't see me so isn't that just great you can't see me because it is so sunny literally vitamin d so if you look in here oh we have emerged little sprutling tulips coming up which is so exciting got a few in here and then there should be some in there but I can't see any yet and then I've got loads down here along the back but yeah spring is oh wow that is really bright <laughs> spring is definitely oh now I'm really dark there we go spring is definitely on its way but let's um just go indoors and set up and let me show you the bits I've got okay I thought I would perch here. It's a bit of a random place to talk to you. I don't have many great like unboxing places downstairs because the light is really, really rubbish and I love natural daylight. I am using a light here to help um, to be able to see me. But it is quite dark this side of the house until it gets really early evening, the sun comes around and this room gets flooded with, with sunlight. But this time of day, it's like 10 past two, it's not great. But I thought I'd just sit here by my back doors and my piano and my good old f and basket. But I have an order, I ordered two things from, is it just ski? J, J Y S K. I don't know how you pronounce that whether you do call it JYSK. But it's like a, um, we haven't got any down here in the southeast, but it's like an Ikea. And there's two things I ordered. So these orders, well, the, this big order, I was massively influenced by Rachel from Home on Cranberry Meadows, if you follow her on Instagram. She saw this on someone else's Instagram stories. I can't remember who. If so, I'll, I'll put her name down below. She saw it on there. And then she tagged her, then Rachel went and bought it, and then I saw it, and I went online, and then I bought it. So yeah, we just all influence each other, and we all just have the same taste, and it's great, and I love it. But while I um, ordered that, which I'll show you second, I just wanted to show you what else I picked up from there, which was a spontaneous purchase. Oh, lovely. So this was not a lot of money. I thought it would be really handy in my new ensuite bathroom that I painted or um, somewhere like that. Oh God, I can't get it out. I think this was a tenner. I'll check my order. But I bought this cute, it's very Zara home. I bought this cute little storage basket and it's got a little, a little handle, like a little keep with a little knot. But yeah, I thought it was really cute for storage. I thought it was a perfect size. Um, ideal in a bathroom and just very Zara home. To be honest, I might even have it in here um, to put like um, 
my TV remotes and everything in. So that's a really good idea actually. Why hadn't I thought that before? I might keep it in here. Okay, I might do that. <laughs> but yeah, I thought it was really cute. I don't think it was a lot. I think it was about a tenner, um, which was cute. But I love the seagrass and yeah, giving me Zara home vibe. So yeah, I'll link this down below for you. But the one reason why I did go on to Jessica, G-Y, G-Y-S-K, Jusk. I don't know if you pronounce it like that. But the one reason is for this bad boy. I'm going to open it up with you. I know you can't really see. I apologise, but it's happening and i hope this is as good as it looked on rachel's stories and the other ladies instagram as well Woo! okay oh it's heavy oh jeez okay hold on yeah get rid of that that's emma make a load of mess get rid of that Get rid of that, get rid of that. So this is my purchase. Look at this. Oh my God, it's massive. I did not expect that to be that big. How good is this? And this, like it's really heavy. I could just about hold it with one hand. I have been to the gym this morning. But you can tell how big this is from kind of comparing it to the size of my face. <laughs> but this was 30 pounds. But 30 quid, guys. As soon as I saw it on Rachel's... I'm going to put money in there. As soon as I saw it on Rachel's stories, I was like, I need that. 30 pounds is insanely good. So I'm going to go and potentially put some florals in this. I'll do that now with you. But I thought it's just like a beautiful... I don't even know what it's made out of, so don't even come at me with that. But it is just a really... Oh, what's that mark on it? two-tone brownie neutral vibes i mean it's gorgeous so let's see if we can um put some flowers in this and style it up quickly style it up with me and then we'll go and do my hello petal order i'm really surprised about this it's really heavy it's gorgeous love it wait oh okay let's go start this up together right say so i'm gonna put it here in the corner like that i'll ignore these frames i got these two frames from um uh, they were a pound each from a charity shop and i'm going to put them up on the wall there with two pictures in but i want pictures that like me and luke or that i've taken when we've been away so i'm trying to like trawl through all my images to get something a good photo and then i'll get that um printed off and i'll put them in here because i think they'll look really nice <laughs> just grabbed a few florals this isn't right these are a bit short so they kind of fall back a bit maybe like that I thought in this beautiful vase ignore the ugly sockets oh no bits come off so yeah there we go I think they look gorgeous in there these are such beautiful florals this is for these were from a foquet if you saw me unbox these they are gorgeous and I think they work perfectly in that vase down there. I had them in this one, but it was a bit short. So now if I put them in here, I could even have a little chair here. I think it will look beautiful. Perfect. Very, very happy with that. I think that looks gorgeous. Top notch, good purchase, 30 quid. I'll link it down below for you. So you can grab yourself one. Right, I have my Hello petal order here which i'm gonna just pot up with you now so um yeah you can see what an order or what i've ordered and what it kind of comes together like first off it's in a beautiful box like this with presentation with a little card from hello petal got my little sticks um let me just grab a chair Right, let's see what I've got in here. Oh, this is exciting. First off, they have been in here for a couple of days. 
So I see that they've started sprouting, but here I've got uh, little bulbs of mascari, which is really cool. And that is the ones that came with this pot. So the kit I went for was this beautiful, I haven't got one of these yet. I love these pots, they're so perfectly imperfect, which is a little bit me. And I've gone for this size pot, which the mascari will obviously sit in there like that. Comes with a little, um, a little saucer, just like that, which is really cute. But I'm gonna now pot these up now. Um, I'll put you on a little time lapse and you can see me potting and um, yeah, let's see what it's gonna look like. So here are my two perfect little potted up plants from Hello Petal. So I went with the refill of the fern in my already little scalloped pot and I also went for the white mascari here which is gorgeous in this nice kind of, I don't know what you'd call that, it's like stripy, stripy pot. So I need to give these both a little water and then I might very well put them on the windowsill I also need to pot up. I bought these herbs from Tesco's earlier. I've gone for um, curled leaf parsley and then also some basil because we're having pasta tonight. So I thought I'd use some of the basil. So very, very happy with my little pot. So these are going to live on the windowsill, I think here, or somewhere where they get some sunlight. And I need, I need to try and keep them alive. I'm really rubbish at keeping plants alive, especially ferns. I need to learn a technique to keep ferns alive because I love ferns. I think they're beautiful. And I'm sorry, but I am totally in matching green today. <laughs> I'm, I've got the dress code 100% down, but um, yeah, I need to learn to keep these little plants alive, but let me pot those up um, because they need to find a windowsill and then we'll find them a little home. Also, I have put my hair in two plaits today because I ended up doing some painting this morning and I wanted to just get my hair out of the way. However, they are not in the best of condition, so let's not judge, okay? Let's not be plat trolls okay let's all just go with the flow sometimes you just gotta put your hair back because you got shit to do <laughs> all right but i potted up the parsley and the basil and it just smells incredible so i need to try and keep this alive i am actually going to oh, squish around here and plop that on that windowsill and then I need to find homes for these little babies. Oh, look at the fern. Do you know what, for now, let's just put both you babies up on here. Oh, look. See, I love having this greenery at home. Beautiful, very happy. So I've just popped out to M&S because I wanted to pick up some of the um, cook in the oven um, what they're called scotch eggs they are to die for i'm not kidding if you love scotch eggs they go in the oven so they're warm and the yolk is yummy yummy the yolk is yum the yolk is runny which is yummy <laughs> but they didn't have any so i'm gonna have to order some off i think it's a cardo that do m &S. i'm not too sure but only m, m do them and they're they're just amazing also picked up some cheese tasters because i fancy a snack also some um of their outdoor honey ham because it's just the best ham in the world and I just like eating ham, which is weird. Oh, and I also picked up, I don't know when this vlog is going out, but I picked up the Love You Very Much Lee um, cute box of um, the mix of chocolate coated nuts, popcorn and pretzels, which I've never had before, but I've heard really good things. But, oh, also the reason why I did go out is that my Sarah Raven order has arrived. So I will go home and show you that, but um, I think this guy is wanting to park in my free half an hour spot. So I'm gonna go and I'll see you back at home. So I completely demolished <laughs> the um, cheese what's it's they were gorgeous. And I need to have a tidy up in the kitchen, but I'm gonna quickly show you my Sarah Raven package before I leave you and go and tidy the kitchen because it is a complete mess. 
Um, so yeah, let me open this and I'll show you. In here. I have ordered from Sarah Raven. Um, all my seeds. Oh, look. So it's a little book of how to grow your seeds, which is very helpful, especially when you're doing it for the first time. Um, five pound off. Oh, amazing. Five pound off code. If anyone wants it, I'll put it down below for you. So the seeds I have ordered are... Okay, I'm not going to try and obviously read these out, but I've ordered those... You've seen these on my Instagram stories before. Dwarf pink blushes. Obviously, this mix. Cosmos, but in like eight and this beautiful like apricot. These look cool. The black cat ones are cute. And I've got sunset. Oh, I didn't order them. Oh. Okay, I didn't mean to order these, I don't think. Oh well, sunset buffs. These I thought were gorgeous. And then just something to fill the beds in are these, the whites, and then another one of cornflower, which I thought was beautiful. So yeah, so these are my range of seeds that I'm gonna plant this year. So fingers crossed I managed to grow some because I'm not the best gardener, but fingers crossed I'll be able to make these whoop, bloom. Don't know when I'm gonna plant them. I need to look in here and look on the backs and it says all oh, when you're meant to obviously plant them indoors outdoors whatever it may be so i need to do a bit of research and see when i'm going to plant each of these so i need to work out what to plant on which days so i'm going to sit down now i'm going to put the tv on uh probably watch a bit of gossip girl have a cup of coffee and work out of what days i'm going to plan what because i think it's time to put my sweet peas in um and i'm going to work out what else i need to put in and when i can start growing them i still haven't got the greenhouse by the way that like the little mini wooden one um i think i'm going to get it next month i think now's a bit too soon because also if i'm going to grow anything it needs to be inside so i think i'll wait for that but i'm going to leave the vlog here hopefully not too long nice and short and sweet but thanks so much for following and i've got lots of organization stuff planned and i'm also going to pop to home sense so my next one could very well be a bit of a tk max home sense trip because i've not been since now let's go before Christmas and that's just insane. I'm having withdrawal symptoms. So I'll probably do that next time. Also with organisation now because we're definitely ready for spring. Things are potted up. Seeds are here. So yeah, I'm definitely ready for the new season. But thanks for watching and I will see you next time.